Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Minecraft with yours truly, the Hermit Hood. How you guys all out there doing today? I'm doing great, and well, not so great, but maybe y'all can make me feel better by hitting that like button, alright? Today guys, what I want to do is, well, last episode I left you guys off with our house over here. We did a little bit of work on it. Um, I promised you guys we would finish up the house here today and we would do a little bit of mining. But on a plus side, guys, there's a little something something that finally grew and it's our pumpkin over there, guys. It's our first pumpkin. Let's go ahead and let's go harvest that because I got a little something something that I want to do with this pumpkin. Okay, so let's go ahead, let's grab our first pumpkin. And we're gonna need something from up on top of these mountains, guys. It's called snow. There's a block in here provided by cork, and it's called snow bricks, okay? Now, how the snow bricks work, oh, my rice is doing nice, 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 nice. Oh, yum, yum, yum. All right, so let's get up there and let's go get some snow, guys. It's called snow bricks, and I think we're going to have ourselves a wee bit of fun with it. Provided that the game doesn't uh, like give me a lag spike or anything of that sort. So let's see if we can get up here. If we can. Can we get up here and get some snow? I want some snow. Alright. Oh, it looks like there's a lot more of those crops up here that I needed too. Awesome. So how many of those do we get? We get two, four, because we need to build a snowman. How many does it take to build a snowman, guys? Is it 16? To build a snowman, what do we need? We need... Okay, that should be more than enough. Um, you only need two blocks to build a snowman. So let's go ahead down here, guys, and let's go build ourselves a snowman. All right, and let's see if we can put him somewhere where he'll stay a little bit safe from the elements, at least. Um, we got plenty of holes in the mountainside over here. You know what I'm going to do with this block of dirt, guys? I'm going to plug up this hole of lava over here, which has been bugging me for a while now. Um, so let's go do that real quick. Um, can I even get up here to do that? Let's see. Here. Can... Yeah, it's just... Yeah. There we go. Goodbye, lava. You've been aggravating me for a while. Haha. -ha. All right. And we got ourselves a little bit of extra cobblestone out of that. So that lava should finally go away. I don't have to worry about the sheeps and the... Uh, cows or whatever else just meandering right into it and you know they just kind of like to go for a gallivant or a walk or anything of that sort i did get myself our first sheep um got an advancement for that i kind of did a little bit of work on our porch over here it's yeah i think i could do better i think i could do a better job than that i'm gonna get some fencing up out of here i think we got some fencing left over uh, that's for my Pam's Harvest Craft stuff. Um, any fencing? I can't really see too well inside of that thing. Um, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Fencing, 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 fencing. Huh. I could have sworn I had fencing left over. Oh, well, we can make some more. Yeah, I can't really see too well. I'm um, giving you a second. Yeah. Um, nope. That that didn't do anything. All right. Um, just give me this, and we'll make some fencing. All right. I think fencing is like this. All right. Nope. All right. Let's try that again. That's crop sticks. And this will give me three. Okay, I know I had fencing around here. Where did I put that, though? Huh. We're just going to need more. All right. Let's just grab this. We're going to go ahead and make a little bit more fencing, guys, so we can, like, kind of block our dude in over here. So, let's see here. We needed sticks in the middle. And this right here. Bada bang, bada boom. All right. That should be good. All right, so we got our fencing, we got this, and let's go see what we can do about our guy here now. All right, so I need to put him somewhere where he'll be safe at the same time where we can mine our stuff up at. I'm going to shove him in the mountainside because what I want to do is I want to be able to 
do our tunnel over here guys we're gonna use snow bricks on this so I'm thinking just temporarily we do got extra stone pickaxes for this uh, just temporarily um, let's see here lots of gravel over here you know what let's put this place to some use All right, let's build our snowman in here, okay? So, let's see here. I got a piece of cobblestone. All right, let's go ahead. We'll place this piece right here. We're going to go bank, bank, um, bank, bank. And we're going to go, all right, I, I hopefully this works. Let's put this. Let's put this. And we're going to go ahead grab this piece. Um, get that off my head, please. And let's see if we can. All right, I think that should work right there. All right, let's get ourselves a shovel, and let's see if this will work. All right, so what I want to do is just not hit him. And just aim right here on the corner. And just get as much snow as I possibly can. That way he's safe from the elements and we get all the snow in the world from this. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go ahead let's turn all that into snow blocks now. Alright, so we just want to do snow blocks right here. Alright, that'll give us that. Let's see what else we got inside of here as far as snow block goes. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right. And what we're going to do is we're going to teach the crafting table a new recipe by going like this. All right. And let's see what these snow bricks look like, guys. I'm probably better off looking in the shadows for this. There we go. So you guys just get a general idea of what these snow bricks look like. All right. And I think we actually need a shovel for this. Nope. You can do it with your hand and get it right back. Awesome. All right. So you guys get a good view of it right here. We get snow bricks. We can break these with our hands. And I'm thinking this should work out nicely on our tunnel over here. All right, that's nice to know that we can use our hands on this. Now, as far as our tunnel goes, guys, it kind of already comes out, like, right in this area, and it goes, like, right here. So, let's see here. We go one, we got two, we got three, and it goes boom, boom, boom. All right, so let's go ahead and let's, mag let's not magic it, but let's see if we can just bring this thing all the way out just kind of like this and with these. But let's also... See if there's another use for these by closing this and let's hit uses. And we can make snow brick stairs and snow brick slabs with it. That's relatively very good to know. That means that we can make our tunnel look even better, guys. So let's go ahead. Let's grab ourselves up some other stuff and things. And that just means that we can do our tunnel and make it look really, really cool. So I'm going to want to bring myself a crafting table over there. I thought I had an extra one. It's right here. Um, I'm also going to accent it with some spruce wood inside of there in places and i'll worry about the house at a later date i'm going to grab my bed and bring that along with me as well um, we got our snowman we got some cobblestone we'll be able to get plenty of it as we dig this thing out um, and plus i can accent this off on the outside as well so let's go ahead let's grab this out and let's figure out what this thing is going to look like on the exterior okay Let's go ahead first off, and let's start with those stairs. There's eight, and let's grab some slabby slab Johnsons out of this thing, and let's see what we can do with this. All right, so first things first I want to do is I want to put one of these right here, okay? And right up here where this is, I'm thinking let's go ahead, let's do something like this, and maybe we go ahead and put a slab in right there to kind of slab that out and make it look a little bit more even. All right, let's put this thing in like right here in this spot. Uh, maybe we do that same thing right here. Let's put our bet down so if we need it, we can use it. 
and get me some torches. And we're going to go ahead and light this up like right here so we can see as we go through the tunnel. Alright. Can we sleep yet? Yeah, we can sleep. There we go. Alright, we're going to take this piece out right here. And I'm going to take this piece right here. Place that leg right there. Um, let's see here. Or maybe instead of doing that... Because it is a tunnel, we go ahead and we use these things and we bring it across like this. Actually, that's not half bad. Let's leave that like that. That way it kind of separates it off, but at the same time, what I think I want to do is I want to bring like an accent block on this thing somewhere if I can, but I'd rather use the spruce wood for that to kind of indent it, maybe bring it around and make it look like it comes up and around it, but let's worry about that later on. Right now, guys, we got ourselves a lot of digging to do, and that's going to include basically what we're looking at right here is all of this. Now got to come out at this angle, and we just got to dig out this huge square so you see where this all goes out at, like right here. And we should be able to get plenty of ores out of this at the same time. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to go ahead and pause. I would do this as a uh, montage, but I don't want to kind of bore you guys. Well, not bore you. Of course I want to bore you. But uh, my computer is not the best in the world for montages or editing right now at the moment. Um, so... Maybe later on, if I can ever afford to do that, I'll do that with you guys. But I'm going to go ahead and dig straight through this mountain, and I'll be right back. Alright guys, I'm back, and I came up with a snow design for this tunnel. Let's go ahead, let's get this thing done here together. Um, you guys will see what it looks like here in just a moment, so... Alright, getting some snow in here right now. Just kind of filling it in just a wee little bit. Um, here's what I kind of came up with right here. So as you come inside of it, we're going to have ourselves a little bit of spruce. Um, I kind of, where is that spruce at? Right here. I'm going to shove in a little bit of, uh, this. I'm going to need this snow brick out of the way. I'm going to need these. That way we can still have ourselves a little bit of lighting. So I'm going to go boom, boom right here. I'm going to grab this torch up out of here and we're going to go straight up with this right into this area and we're going to take this torch and we're going to go right here and right here with it um fill this in with a little bit of cobblestone right here this way we can still you know if we want to we can add a cart or something coming through here um, but it kind of lights it up on both sides just a little bit here so we go ahead same exact pattern right in here add or suffer a little bit of this coming down through here uh, same thing over here. Just kind of fill it in back there so nothing spawns in here. I see that I do have some, you know, coal in the ground. I could scoop that up. I just don't want to deal with that right now at the moment. I just want to get this tunnel done because I promised you guys I'd do this with you. So let's go ahead. Let's get this out of the way. Um, let's pull this up. You see the light at the end of the tunnel. That's a really good thing. All right, boom, boom. All right, bink. All right, let's get this in here and up there. All right, a little bit more torchy torch action in here, we, which means we can go ahead and start to pull these things up off the floor in here so we don't have torches spammed out all over the place. Eventually, I'll upgrade these things to candles, but for right now, um, yeah, I kind of don't want to deal with that. I just want to kind of just get this stuff in here and put it in and... We'll see what happens after that. I gotta come up with a design for the exterior over here on this side. So we, we gotta do that. So let's go ahead, let's pull these in here. That in there like that. And we'll go ahead and add these torches down like this. That way this is all nice and lit up, coming the whole way down in here. All right. Um, we're gonna need our stairs now. So let's go ahead and get some stairs and slabs. And let's finish up our tunnel here, guys. Let's get this thing off of here 
And we're going to go ahead and go bada bang, bada boom. We're probably going to need a little bit more of that. Let's go ahead and get more. Oop. All right. Let's grab these. Put these right here. Um, give me some of these. Boop. All right. That's probably a little bit more than necessary uh, right there. Um, all right. Stairs first. Run these things coming the whole way down the length on both sides. And right over here on this side, looks like we probably could have used a little bit more snow stairs. So, yep. Uh oh. Alright, get that up. Nice to see you still get everything back. Yeah, could use a little bit more because we got to run on both sides as well here, too. Let's get those. Um, let's just grab a half a stack and do that with it. There you go. That should work out more than enough. More than enough. Hopefully. Hopefully I'm right on that. Alright, we're going to take these. We're going to run them up high. I'd love to be able to run some candles inside of here eventually. So we'll have to see what happens with that. Alright, here we go. I'll run this the whole length. Again, we ran out of stairs. That's okay. Alright. Hopefully enough. Come on. It's getting dark out. We gotta get this done. Boom, 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 and boom, and boom. Alright, we got this. Alright, let's get ourselves a nap, nap in real quick, guys. There we are. Here we go. Add our slabs in, and then we got to go do the other end of the tunnel on the outside, and we should be good. I'm stuck on this. Maybe we'll do grass on the inside of this, coming down this. Um, I'm running and running and running and completely forgetting about we got to do this up here. There we go. Then we can get a full view of what this looks like once it's done. There we go. All right, so our tunnel is basically coming out like this. Um, we have our snow brick slabs right here, kind of running around the edge. Let's go ahead and put these in here, kind of like this. So we have them already set in place. Um, I could probably use another workbench over here on this side because we're going to have ourselves. This is where it's going to go out into the fields. So if we come out this way, this is where it's going to exit to go out to the modern district. So I'm probably going to want to build myself a little bit of a bridge for something that goes out towards this. So if we look out there, guys, there's the modern district over there on that side. Over here is where we're going to be doing all of our stuff and things at. So I really don't care what this looks like over here. Um, this thing right here is definitely going to get pulled up out of here. Um, let me get some, my inventory is a mess. There we go. All right. So here's our snow bricks. Here's our crafting bench for over here. Um, I need my grub. There we go. And snow bricks. Let's go ahead and shove these things in here. Like so, boom, boom, and you know what I'm going to do, guys? I think I'm going to go ahead because I think I'm going to go ahead and just make this thing a solid like I did on the other side. All right, let's pull this out. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go ahead and make this solid. see if that looks about right yeah that looks a little bit better okay and plus it's solid and I think it looks a little bit better and more clean this way than just the way it was sitting before now I can go ahead and pull these things out this right here is basically it's just a brace because when I came through here um, I opened up to the outside so I just kind of like had to shove something in it in its place I'll clean that up with some stone or maybe I'll do some landscaping on top of it I got a lot of these brush things over here which is a good thing that'll give me a lot more things stuff things to work with this right here got to get torn out of here I'll worry about that later on um, did I leave a chest over here I think so no okay 
Now, a lot of you are probably wondering, where am I going to do my main mining at? Okay, are we going to, whoa, uh, where are we going to do our main mining at inside the game? Okay, because we need to be able to do, go do some mining underground. All right, and at the moment, right now, we have yet to do any mining, really any at all. And I'm just doing surface mining at the moment. Um, I keep looking up at that thing because it's irritating me. Um, I'm going to have to tear that thing down. This inside of here, it looks good and all, but I'm thinking of extending the grass to go the whole way through it. Um, maybe I'll put snow pathing on top of it. I mean, I do got plenty of snow on me. I mean, <laughs> but no, maybe we'll do something different on that. Um... I'm thinking of taking a grass and running it straight through it is what I'd love to be able to do. Um, we'll see what happens on that. Um, maybe we could use some larch wood on it. Mix it with larch wood and grass. Do a little bit of little. Um, we'll finish up the house that we have to do. Um, do that next episode for sure. Because I spent a lot of time working on this. It looks good over here because this is where we're going to be doing a lot of our work for like mm, crafting and stuff and things but i don't know what to say guys i got a lot of stuff on my mind and i really just wanted to get that tunnel done today um one thing i definitely want to get down here and do is i want this rubber tree out of here because yeah i'm thinking we might establish a mine shaft over here i'll see where i can get it is this a rubber tree please tell me you're a rubber tree yes so we can get started on industrial craft here soon please be industrial craft it's 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 rubber cool i'd love to get started on industrial craft maybe we can learn a thing or two from it <laughs> Is this another rubber tree? Maybe. Yes, it is. Cool. And we got another sapling from it. Okay, cool. So we can do some IC2. Um, I need a good cave so we can do, do some caving. Um, the music is a bit loud. I apologize for that. Um, finally these things are growing and expanding and my rice field is doing nice so i should be able to get myself lots of rice bread out of this yes let's see how much rice we can get out of this harvest guys Stop eating it. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and munch on this. And we're gonna go ahead and take this right here. We're gonna go bank. There's that. That's 42 loaves of bread. There's 52 loaves of bread right there. So I just take this right here and I'm gonna throw it in my furnace and we got 52 loaves of bread right there. Cool. Well, there's another thing we can do with this, and I'm going to show you guys that right here in, in a moment before I end the episode. I want to do this. Um, I remember this because it's a shortcut to get the slime. Um, if I take this and I go one, two, I do that right there. That's actually additions. It's a slime ball. We could use that for making leads, or we can use it for making name tags and stuff and things like that. So here you go, guys. Watch this. So... Let's head outside. Let's grab ourselves a little bit more water. I'm going to show you a shortcut to getting slime. All right. So, uh, I mean, eventually I'll show you guys all the mods and all that stuff and things. But you'll have to download these things yourself. Um, yeah, I want to show you guys all the mods, what the versions of there are, them are, and all that stuff and things. But... I just don't want to do that today. Here we go. Here's eight. So we need one more bucket of water and we should be able to do this. We should be able to get our first slime block. I want my first slime block of the season. 
I want my first slime ball. So let's do this, guys. Something to make me happy. I want my first legit... Well, it's not legit, but I want my first slime block. You know, the one that, that's made in vanilla. Okay, so here. Make me happy. Let's do this. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, so we got 12 rice slime balls, right? Watch this. Boom. Okay, guys. I got a slime block. <laughs> Now, I'd like to do with this is I'd like to put it right here. And I, I'd like to be able to do it, guys. Ooh. You know what? Here's a question. Give me this. If I can craft up enough of these, if I can craft up enough of these, what do you guys think of using that for a floor coming through here? <laughs> Let's see what it would look like. All right, let's just see for a second. What would that look like if we added this for a floor inside of here? Oh, that would look slick. Would it slow us down, though? Yeah, it would slow us down. It's a little, it's a sticky floor. Snow is a little bit sticky, is it not? But it would slow us down to a crawl. And maybe not. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. But I think it would look neat in there. I think it would. How did that just happen? Okay. Um, let's go with you. Let's go. All right. So grass guys or slime? Grass or slime for inside of here? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode. Y'all take care. Have yourself a wonderful day. I got a big mountain or something to remove. I'm going to play some Force of Nature, upload this thing and that, and I'll see you all next episode. Catch you later. Bye-byes.